Hey, Chris Savino, happy National Cartoonist Day. I prefer to call myself a cartoonist over anything else in the world. I love cartooning, and today I'm gonna to draw you a Loud House comic strip and kind of explain the process of what I'm doing and hopefully you'll enjoy the process. So this is a rough, I do it in a lighter color on a separate layer and I will change the opacity down so that I'm barely seen and it makes it look like I'm drawing freehand. Comic strips were the thing that I wanted to do from the age of four on. I think newspaper comic strips are one of the most amazing inventions as far as art goes that still to this day makes me so giddy to see when someone kind of rises above what people have done before. The Loud House is inspired 100% by comic strips and my passion for them. The thing I love most about comics and, and what most people don't get to see is the process before it goes to print. So seeing the actual physical art with all the mistakes and all the pencil marks and the ink all on top is the thing that gets me the most excited about comics. This particular comic is about Lincoln wearing pretty much all of his sister's clothes because with 10 people in the family, Sometimes laundry doesn't get sorted well. Charles Schultz, who did The Peanuts, and one of my like huge influences, always said, only draw what you need. If it's not important, don't add a lot of detail. If it is important, that's where your detail comes in, because it'll focus the eye on what's most important. That is my comic for National Cartoonist Day. Hopefully you learned something from this, at least not about cartooning itself, but about how I feel about cartooning, which to me, it is a lifelong passion, a lifelong obsession. I think that sometimes when you look at the final work, you forget about the, the hand that was behind it, and it's good to celebrate the hand that's behind it.